So imagine this. Imagine we're talking about um, a classic survey question. What is your likelihood to purchase the next 30 days? Let's just say, you know, this is, uh, this is uh, celebrities trying to, uh, planning to purchase a new private plane. Say we surveyed 250 celebrities. Now the, the cross tab here gives you a total, then it gives you, then it breaks it out. This is a classic one that just works by gender. Total female and male. So of the 250 total folks, 104 were female and 146 were male. Then we start to see the other variables. Not at all likely, unlikely, uncertain, likely, very likely. So of those 170 people, said, or of those 250, excuse me, 170 of them said not at all likely, 37 said unlikely, 16 said uncertain, 6 said likely, and 21 said very likely. But we see that those results are a little bit different by gender. You can see the green results give you the overall, but the second green box tells you the differences between the women and the men. And when you look at it, the people that the company cares about the most, the people who are very likely to purchase, trying to figure out how you can convert that desire into an actual action, 8.4% of the people who responded were very likely to purchase. But when you look at that, only 2% of women are very likely to purchase, but 13% of men are very likely to purchase. That's a big difference. Why is it that women are so much less likely to respond very likely to this question? So if I'm a private plane company, the first thing I'm going to do is try to figure out, okay, how do I turn these men into customers? How do I actually get them to you know, pull the trigger and uh, increase my conversion rate here? But I'm also going to wonder, what are the factors that are keeping women from from being likely to buy my product. And what and why how might we change that? Some of those factors might be under the company's control and some of the factors might not be. But if I'm a private plane company and I'm seeing this kind of gender disparity in my purchasers, I'm going to wonder why it is that uh, women aren't as interested in my product as men.